First thing we did, we put together a place where we could share information. We put everything in there we could think of. Links to key personnel, feeds from news and rumor sites, stock tracker, a place where we could share documents, a place where we could upload and share video if we needed. And then we started digging. We looked at the competition. Was someone going to beat us to market? We were the only ones in the space. We looked at our assets. Were they secure? Could someone have stolen some code? Catherine got the first clue. She was talking to security, looking for anomalies. Bingo. It turns out security had found the remains of a smoke bomb in the garbage can. You know, like you use for gophers. Someone set it off. Someone inside. We had a mole in the company. A mole? But who? I don't know who came up with the idea. Maybe Brandon? We started scanning all the video records. Maybe a camera somewhere saw something. We were desperate at that point. Bullseye. Turns out, a webcam down in engineering had been left on during the fire alarm. It wasn't much, but it was all we had. I needed a closer look. On the bigger screen, I still couldn't tell who it was or what I was looking at. There was something familiar. I just couldn't place it. Something was going on. I had to let management know. No, uh, one moment, sir. Everybody leaving, and this person going the other way. And you think it's a mole? Yes, sir. Trying to steal the polyglot plants? Something like that. If they had done that, don't you think we know by now? I mean, in less than an hour, we launch, and then doesn't matter. I appreciate your concern, Johnny. Jimmy. And your hard work, but I don't see anything here to get worked up about. Well, but I... I uh... All of a sudden, I knew what was going on. The mole wasn't trying to steal Polyglot. He was trying to sabotage it. The question was, was there time to stop it? Mm -hmm.